to the Goons Podcast. The uh, first podcast in the world to use power tools. Uh, <laughs> we all know you what, use that what, to pleasure yourself. What is that? I do. I do. Drill There's dough. not even a drill bit on the end of it. Plug. Yep, drill dough. I learned what that is because of you guys. Yeah. Drill dough. Yeah, mm-hmm. you put a dildo on the end of a drill and it just spins around. I don't know, I guess the balls slap mm. around and... I don't know. This mm. yeah, call from Stewart, Florida. Answer it. I don't know. Answer it. <laughs> answer the call. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, <laughs> the, I hope wait, they what record their calls. <laughs> yeah. Dude, what, I what always the- answer spam callers. It's hilarious. I know. Every <laughs> single time there's one that happens when we're in a game or in a call, you answer it. You, I hope one calls me during the podcast. You are a spam caller most of the time. <laughs> True. <laughs> okay, but I'm not trying to scam people out of their health insurance. <laughs> That's true. No, You're just trying different. to order a Baconator. I would beg to differ. <laughs> <laughs> uh, sound like I want to give me your health insurance. Have you guys any uh, ever had any relatives that have like almost fallen for that? My grandpa called me like two weeks ago and he was panicking because his, his Amazon account was going to get um, terminated and like he needed to pay to have it put there or put back. And he was like freaking out over the phone about it. <laughs> Yeah, he was yeah. like the email, dude. It was such a bad. How do you get email. an Amazon account terminated? What That's dude. Okay, no, hold on. It gets even better. I was talking to him about it, and I was like, okay, like, have you ordered anything off Amazon, like where they would have your credit card? And he's like, no, I've never even been on Amazon. So he never even had an account. He just and read. He was worried this, about. He just campaign. read this email that told him he was, his account was going to get terminated oh if he didn't God. pay, and he just started panicking, and he called me freaking out. And I was, like, walking him through it, trying to get onto his Amazon account to figure out what's going on. And then he sent me the email, and I asked him about Amazon, and he didn't even have a fucking account. So he's just freaking out. <laughs> Old people are so dumb. They are. Very, very true. I always wonder, like, if telemarketers and scam callers and all that are going to die off with, like, the old generation. You know, like, when our generation becomes the new old right. people. I actually never well, thought about might, that before. That's... They might just get better because, like, I've gotten some emails that were genuinely, like, believable. Like, there's yeah, yeah. been some where, like, it looks like it's from Netflix and I never actually click on the link from emails just because you just never know, yeah. so I don't bother. I just go on Netflix and then, like, go through my settings and make sure it's all good. But, yeah, like, there is some that, that look real even to somebody who's, you know, at least mm-hmm. somewhat educated on them. I always read the actual sender's email address. That's yeah, how that's I always like, find that's out. That's what you got to give away. Because yeah. usually it'll be like Netflix.ZZXY2213, like some fucked yeah. up mm-hmm. uh, amount of letters and words. If you know, like if it says Netflix.com, obviously you know it's real. Right. Even still, like even if it actually is an official email, I still always double check. Well, the official emails is not shit like, hey, you need to pay $500 to get your account online. Yeah, <laughs> and it has to be in pre This is the Bank shit. of Uganda. $300 to keep Netflix, please. Exactly. <laughs> $300 to keep Netflix. <laughs> like more than a whole year of Netflix. We are holding your movies for ransom. Pay to get them back. <laughs> um, I remember that happened with my dad uh, one time. When I first started doing... Uh, like IT school back when I was like nineteen twenty, um, he uh, there. Have you ever heard of ransomware? Uh, no, I've I've heard the term. I'm not super familiar with it though. It's like it's basically malware on your computer. Like it's a virus, but it's intended to get you to pay to get rid of something. And uh, it's like one of those things where you can't even turn on your computer without it just taking up your entire screen. Oh, well, he like- got he got one of those one time, and it was like. It was saying, like, we have detected be on your computer. And he was, like, he was freaking the fuck <laughs> out. Maybe censor that word out. And, uh, he, yeah, he, he was freaking out big time. And, uh, yeah, I just went around and was like, yeah, it's just a virus. You don't have shit like that on your computer. And he was yes. like, yeah. As, oh as we were talking about this, I just got a text that says, join free. And the, uh, the, the link is HTTP slash soft pussy. 
us available, <laughs> I'm here. Dude, <laughs> they are fucking relentless. I get shit like that all the fucking yeah, time. So do dude. I. Really? Uh, dude, yes. I get emails, or not emails, I get phone calls and like weird text all the Stop goddamn time. Pussy.com. I just get yeah, yeah, like, Florida dude, about the like, hotel. There's like, like seven hard people pussy. tagged in this too. Dude, like, that's why I waste their time. Sent to. When they call me, I always answer, and I'm always like, let's let me suck your cock and balls. Like, I always just do some <laughs> bullshit. so mad if you fuck with them. <laughs> like, yeah. uh, have you guys ever watched Kit Boga? Uh, I believe that's oh, how yeah. you pronounce it. No. Um, he just fucks with, like, spam callers and shit that are trying to rip people mm-hmm. off. Dude, it's so funny because they have the same line every time they get mad. It's just like, fuck your mother, I'll fuck your mother, yeah. your mother's <laughs> yeah. gonna get fucked. Yeah. Yeah. Just yep. like, oh, exactly. like, They make such a switch from, like, this, like, uh, like it's personality so of like a customer service person right, like, just like I'm fuck sorry, you sir. Face, I'm bitch, sorry, sir. Yeah, I cussed I cussed at one first uh, the other day and he's like why you use bad language you are on recorded line and or some shit like that and I was like why you tried to scam you are a piece of shit and then he was just like fuck you bitch and I was like why you use bad language on recorded line <laughs> oh you pissed him off <laughs> I remember when a spam caller uh, called when we were recording that War of <coughs> War Dude, of Tanks uh, bit. Tanks. It was the same guy. It was the same guy actually that called. The he called me guy? again. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was the same guy that called me again. What What did he say he was going to do? Didn't he say he was going to like fuck your dad or something? Yeah, he was. Uh, <laughs> no, he said he was like, "I'm gonna fuck your wife," and I was like, "I have a husband." <laughs> He's like, "I will oh, fuck yeah, your yeah. husband," yeah. or something like that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, that was so Dude, funny. That guy definitely plays COD when he's not. Absolutely. <laughs> he's just like, wait a minute, are you soup? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, imagine that. Imagine you're that like like I wonder if celebrities ever get a spam caller who just like starts fangirling because they find out it's like Lady Gaga or something. Like somebody that's famous I would enough. Imagine for- Lady Gaga would hang up the phone before. <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah, I guess if you're that famous, you probably just have somebody that answers all your phone calls. You just probably, don't have to yeah. do anything. God, what a life. Just, just not having to do anything. Just paying everybody to do all your bullshit. Kind of like how we now. pay an editor to do yeah. all this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I guess I so. pay somebody just, to clean the house for me. Yeah, that we works. have to do hour of talk. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I guess it ain't so bad out here. <laughs> nah. <laughs> um, all right, are we done with that? Because I have an actual topic that <laughs> is is kind of boo boo aids, but that's okay. Good. Um, okay. Do you guys think you like okay? Do you think you could go to heaven or whatever afterlife you you want, but you have to fight every animal you've ever eaten on the way there? <laughs> <laughs> what? That's not even a topic. It's just like a. No, I would have yeah, to I, fight. Essentially, I'm so asking: many do, you think, do you think you could just take like two hundred thousand chickens in a mean fist like, fight? Dude, do you mean like, like one, on your way okay. on your way to the one gates of heaven? You're just type or like beating all the animals. fuck out of chickens. In my mind, I imagined like an ec- an extra large version of whatever you you said. <laughs> like two hundred thousand chickens combined into one. No, Right, yeah, like one massive Dude. fucking chicken, like some big twin tower sized chicken. That's what I, I was. That. You know how in Zelda, if you beat up the chickens, like a ton of them fly at you. That would be my mm-hmm. fight. Yeah, you would just have all <laughs> chickens, wouldn't you? Pretty like much. Soups would just well, be. Well, you gotta think like about it realistically. Cows. Just because, just because it's a big chicken or like a big cow, <laughs> doesn't mean that it's an angry chicken or an angry cow. Like you could easily. Walk up to a giant cow and just slit its throat and then it just dies. I feel like you got this topic from like some Tumblr vegan post. Like what if you (laughs) wanted to go to heaven but you had to fight every animal you ever (laughs) ate. (laughs) They just punching cabbages on their way up to heaven, bro. Uh, Dude, I would have to fight like some deer, a kangaroo. An alligator? Yeah, you'd have I'd to find fun. a lot more you'd animals than us. An alligator, yeah. yeah. Fuck that. <laughs> For me, it's a cow, chicken, pig. That's pretty much it. Pretty yeah, much. All, I got a rabbit. I've eaten Lamb. one rabbit. I don't know how um, to fight a shrimp. I don't know if I could do it. <laughs> <laughs> I think you could just <laughs> probably push Giant that Giant shrimp is just laying there on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> it's just not even moving. Like eight stories tall. <laughs> God, like, brings it out in front of you. He's like, you know what? Just forget this one. Never mind. <laughs> Go ahead and eat it. <laughs> God's oh, I forgot about seafood. There'd be a lot of fish. 
like salmon flapping around. Yeah, there'd be, yeah, I'd, yeah, dude, I'd okay, fight so, so many crabs. Would, okay, but uh, the real question is, if you had to fight a fish, would you be underwater or would the fish be on on land? To the fight? fish gotta go to heaven, bro. So, like, you're on your way to heaven. So it's, I, I assume that's so in the air. So lungs don't, don't matter know. anymore. It can be on the land. Yeah. Yeah, so it's just going to be dead if it's like it, the fish really won't put up much of a fight, I imagine. And on top of that, like <laughs> if a salmon is just like there, like what what is a salmon going to do to you? I know they're big, but like it's not like it's going to stab you. Like it's it's got it little like, finnies. It could crush you. Oh, I've like had a shark ass... before. I had to fight a fucking shark. Oh. Yeah, you, you would die. You gotta stop eating you weird shit, bro. <laughs> yeah, you're done. I really <laughs> hope that the afterlife don't really work like this cuz you're screwed. <laughs> Yeah, I really so hope God a isn't a vegetarian. Don't be fucked. God's vegan. <laughs> yeah. Gross. Not my uh, God. Well, that, uh, that, that. <laughs> Not my Jesus. <laughs> Wonder if, I, actually, you know what? I wouldn't, I wouldn't put it past people to eventually be like, yeah, yeah, white Jesus was vegan. I love white people mean? fan I'm, fiction I'm, Jesus. I'm, I am sure that is a thing. That's probably I'm already like, happened. Yeah. There well, is a, a Tumblr people, page out I've there. I've heard that, that people that. claim that Jesus and God were vegan because like God what? like loves all creatures or whatever and he wouldn't like kill animals. Bro, like, there's no I've way heard. the Pope is vegan. Is the Pope vegan? I'm curious. I have no idea. I don't Tom Brady's know. vegan and he's the Pope. So yeah. Tom Brady's vegan and he's the Pope. <laughs> I, he's our spiritual so leader. Mean. The, Catholic, the Catholic spiritual Tom Brady leader. is God. <laughs> Dude, I knew I hated Twitter. Like, I already knew I hated Twitter, but I especially knew I hated it when I saw people getting pissed off at Tom Brady for getting drunk after winning the Super Bowl. Wait, what? <laughs> really? What's what? he supposed to do? Yeah, I was reading Since this Twitter when is that a bad thread. Thing? I was reading this thread that was just like, uh, you're a role model to children. Why are you getting drunk and like. Acting because a fool. he's a legal adult. What the fuck? Yeah, what are you like, yeah, like, oh, doing? He's like acting a fool on social media or something like that. And like, I read a reply that was like, "The public gets drunk because it's a Friday. He won like a <laughs> he championship. Won his, yeah. <laughs> he's a 40, Seriously. What, forty. Yeah, forty-three year old man. I, I think he's allowed to drink, <laughs> and he's yeah, in Florida. Dude. You don't have to do anything to drink there. You go to a business meeting and get sloshed. It's Florida. Who fucking cares? Yeah, I, dude. Yeah, people were mad at Tom Brady for getting drunk. Like, I didn't dude, need he to get won a the life fucking for a Super job Bowl or something. He won the fucking Super Bowl. How? Oh man, I don't know, dude. People, people just want to be retarded. mad about it. if they've like. I feel like it's just people that have never had anything wrong happen to them, or just like, I gotta, I gotta hate somebody else for doing something. Like, yeah, I don't know. It's just, just slightly don't agree with. Yeah, yeah, let's just cancel Tom Brady out. for getting drunk after winning the Super Bowl. <laughs> cancel all drunks while you're Why at it. him? Like, they don't give a fuck about anyone else on the team getting destroyed. Like, I'm sure there's some yeah, players that are, like, snorting lines off hookers' asses after the game. Like, <laughs> why Tom <laughs> yeah. Brady for drinking? <laughs> well, he's the only role model there, so, you know. Yeah, he's yeah. a role model for kids. Yeah, right. I can't imagine what Gronk did after the Super Bowl. Just beat probably, his like, wife smuggled or something. guns into Mexico or something. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what Gronk did. Let's celebrate. That's, what, it. It That's what he did. <laughs> Complete side note. Have you guys seen the size of that man's fucking hands? Gronk? Yeah. No. Dude, Gronk they, hand. They are <laughs> fucked. Like, they don't look real. Like, you know when you were a kid and you had the Hulk hands? Yeah, it That's just real. it yeah. looks like that. Wow! When you shake someone's hand, it just swallows it. It absorbs it. Well, that's probably why he's a really good receiver. He, big hand, catch a big ball, and then you can choke me. Me grunk, me catch big ball. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Here, the viewers can't see this, but look at it like compared to his head. <laughs> His hand is bigger than his whole fucking head. Bro. Dude, I bet <laughs> if he slapped you, <laughs> oh. you would die. <laughs> Absolutely. He looks like such a fucking he should, goober. He should go into those, like, <laughs> he really he's like, <laughs> oh, God. He's like a Pokemon. He can only say his first name or his last name. <laughs> Part of his last name. Dude, Have you seen the, he, <laughs> he should enter those slapping Not contests, those sla man. That'd be uh, fantastic. That he if, would yeah, play because the other player out. would feel real good slapping a fucking NFL player. Well, if NFL <laughs> didn't work out for him, theoretically, he could have just slapped people. 
Yeah. Just, that's what I'm saying. He, he would have never lost. Oh, me grunk, me already multimillionaire. Must join slapping competition to make more money. <laughs> is, he, is he Russian? I don't know. <laughs> uh, Gronkowski kind of sounds like a Russian name. That's, that sounds Jewish. Dimitro. What? <laughs> what? Your <laughs> mic cut out. Totally just, just, just gave Dimitri. up. <laughs> it's like Putin just shot him in the back of the head. <laughs> <laughs> McNasty? He hasn't spoke since either. McNasty oh, died. Hey, this whole hello, I'm back. <laughs> oh. Did you get wow. the KBG just trying to wipe you off I the planet? New, I bought a new uh, like thing for my <laughs> mic, and it just like auto turns off sometimes. What? Why That's would you really buy something good. that auto turns off? I didn't know it auto turned <laughs> off, but it, it auto turns <laughs> off after like a day. I don't know. It just randomly does it. So. <laughs> what is it's it? Like a KGB agent came up behind you with like a <laughs> rope and just grabbed you. Behind <laughs> just some just piano you out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyways, on to the next topic. Uh, next topic now. He's I don't American, have a topic, by the way. <laughs> oh, well, obviously. Yeah. I don't believe that for a second. Um, you can't tell by just looking at him. Oh, yeah, I mean, <laughs> fair enough. Anyone else have another topic? I don't even have one right now. I don't even know what we were just talking about. Uh, 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 why were we talking? Dude, why are we all so dumb? We were talking about if Gronkowski was Russian or not. No, before that. Like, what was the topic oh, that like even got topic? us on a... Um, 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 I got a good how topic. How do people listen to this? <laughs> Dude, Nicholas no Cage. <laughs> Nicholas Cage is going to be... In like a fry, a Five Nights at Freddy's like movie. Yeah, uh, my this, stream uh, was telling me oh, about really? that. Like what? I think it actually came out today, the day that we're recording this. Really? Apparently, yeah. the cast is absolute heat. I didn't, I didn't look, but my <laughs> my, my stream was I just can't telling tell me that sarcasm. Or <laughs> no, <laughs> my stream was telling me that there's actually like A list actors in Five Nights at Freddy's. The film. But it's not oh actually God. Five Nights at Freddy's. It's called oh, Willy's Diesel. Wonderland. Vin Diesel got to be in there. What? Well, wait, what? So why is it Five Nights at Freddy's movie if it's not called Five? Is it just like the B same Because plot? it's like the, the same kind of, uh, the same meme, I guess. Have you guys ever actually played that game? I have never played nope. it. No, I just I've I watched a Markiplier it. play it once yeah. and I was like, this is not for me. Yeah. I never really liked games that were just solely made for jump scares. No, that's that's fair. They're like I, fun to it. Like when when you're playing a story based horror game and then there's jump scares, then yeah, it's fun. But literally, yeah, a game like that's the, specifically jump just made for like suspense and jump scares. Yeah, it's dumb to me. The uh, you play the Freddy's. Resident Evil <laughs> Resident Evil games? Those are like perfect amount of like gameplay versus uh, spooky scary. Those are. I'm those gonna are risk getting COVID time. to go watch that movie. I don't give a damn. Wait, are there theaters that's open there? Probably, I'll find one. Some little, yeah, I get, you're in Carolina. There's some, some little fucking hey, barrel closure. shack. <laughs> people barrel don't really shack. care in these parts of the states about COVID. It's kind of a myth made by 5G radio <laughs> towers. China. You know what else is a myth? What? Huh. Yeah. I didn't think You were going to say some kind of race right there, weren't you? And then you realized you we were, were recording a podcast. <laughs> Actually, what? never mind. Wow. I cannot confirm nor deny. A uh, unicorn. Unicorns are a myth. Yeah. Correct. Yeah, that's the one. That's just true. <laughs> And Mexicans. <laughs> All right. Uh, they are very we, real. We got a, they're yes, they are. I live in California, too. There's yeah. a lot of living treading. in a house made by one, probably. <laughs> we are yeah. treading in deep waters. What, Mexico? <laughs> <laughs> yes, we're treading in Mexico. We're treading in Tacos over house? the border. Oh, no, I say. Drifting into Mexico. Do you guys have, drift like... into Mexico. There's a fucking wall blocking us. Do you guys have... Uh, are there, like, a lot of Mexican people where you live? Me? Uh, I feel like no. there's a lot of Mexican people everywhere. Yeah. Well, I mean, like, I know, like, where I live, California, there's a lot, because that's... Well, of course. And then, like, Dude, Texas, the Mexican food, too. though, in California, oh, yeah, the is Mexican just... food here is bomb. Mm. Oh, it must be so good. Even, like, Americanized so Mexican food is just fire, but, like, uh, like traditional, authentic Mexican food, yeah. Pretty... What do you think japanese fied Mexican food tastes like? Japanese the fuck did you just say? Is that Korean a word? taco? <laughs> Japanese and then I forgot. Japanese sounds like a word guide. from like Pee Wee Herman show or something like some made up kid <laughs> sounds word. Sounds like a dinosaur name. <laughs> <laughs> I, oh I, shit! I don't know what was it. What else did you say? Everything else just shut off after that word. What else was the question? I said, what do you think Japanese fried Mexican food tastes <laughs> like? It like? happened again. Why don't like I a sushi right. taco? So if there's like, ew. If there's like a Taco Bell in Japan. 
w- what would the menu be like? Right. Probably Mexican. Sushi taco. <laughs> I don't know. Because Doritos Loco. I'm pretty raw sure fish. in like. Oh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure in like Hong Kong, like McDonald's have like curried eggs. Yeah, yeah, they got a lot of weird things. Things. Oh, dude, we should take a trip to Hong Kong and just try the McDonald's. The fishy five layer home. burrito. You know what, soup? I would be down for that. Once COVID lifts, I'm trying to trying to travel. Pizza. I don't care where we go. I'll go all the way to Hong Kong to try McDonald's with you. You know, I I was curious one day on YouTube. I was just you know doing Baja my browsing. Fish. Okay. <laughs> There are people <laughs> that make airport restaurant review videos. Really? Really? Yeah, I watched one of like an obscure Burger King in <laughs> some airport, just <laughs> out of pure <laughs> boredom and curiosity. And it was like <laughs> just this guy reviewing like Terminal A, Section One <laughs> Burger King Airport. Like, <laughs> just so fucking what is that stupid. for? Is anyone actually benefiting from this information? Yeah, this for? <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to know. That's so... Why would you base your channel off of that? Yeah. I don't want to well, know who's dude, actually watching that. There's a... There's one channel I watch, and he is, he is living the life. He, like, goes to Japan and shit and just tries to find the most expensive restaurant he can and then just films it, doesn't even talk or anything. And and that's his whole thing, and he gets like millions of views. Oh. That's so like he just lit. films himself eating, and people yeah, watch it. Yeah, like yeah, literally, like he just like goes to Japan. Like the one of my like I think his most popular videos um, is eating olive wagyu in Japan, which is like like the the hardest to get wagyu, to, from my understanding. Um, but yeah, he doesn't talk <laughs> once. He just holds the camera, watches a chef make it. And and then eats silently and like I think, that vi- I think that video that. has like hold on let me see how many videos or how many views that has. Why don't we just recreate that but make it actually entertaining and talk, say literally yeah. anything. That has fifty two million <laughs> views. Holy shit! Oh my god. All he oh did my god. was uh, silently eat steak in Japan for fifty two million. I look views. at dicks for like twenty hours for ten million views. This dude just goes eats good food. Yeah, he just goes and eats wagyu in Japan and zero penises. <laughs> well zero wieners. The only meat know. is what he's eating. Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> uh, dude, can we make a goons food review channel in the future? Just a goons anything channel. Goons anything. Goons everything. I just want to hang out with the boys. <laughs> goons gardening <laughs> reviews. <laughs> goons sewing channel. <laughs> Making quilts with the goons. Oh, uh. There's so much. Fuck. There's unlimited content in the world. We can just do it. Oh, that would. I, I'm down for what? that one. Bow. I didn't hear what he said. Yeah. Goons guitar. Yeah. Goons guitar. Oh, I mean, guitar. you already pretty much do goons guitar. Just yeah, no yeah, you are the goon guitar. <coughs> Excuse me. What was? Was that? Was I just was that a gay cough? This last bit of soda. Oh. Gay cough. Gay what cough? is a gay cough? What is that? I don't know. Cough. <laughs> that happens when you're gay. I'm not just be a regular cough, or well, is it from like drowning no, in no, the cough? Close. Well, There's well, way too so much semen in that cough. Why does the cough have a sexual preference? <laughs> <laughs> I hear dry cum in that cough. In that cough. <laughs> too much sin in that cough, boy. Go to go to church. <laughs> too much sin. We're gonna pray the cough gay out like of that cough, boy. <laughs> I know what a like devil coughs cough. like. I made him choke on my cock, and he coughed. <laughs> I want to leave the, the devil. Mid podcast wake up time. That's where everyone is falling asleep so far. Time to wake up. Time to wake up. Back to Goons Church and back to Goons Church and we start a, a Goons Church channel? Dude, we, sure, we yes. talked about that last podcast. We, we yeah, just no, we need to become the goons. Re- yeah, we did. The goons religion. So we never no, have to pay didn't. taxes again. We absolutely talked we about talked goons religion. We talked about this last podcast. We absolutely Don't worry about Soup right now. He's just on. Uh, we talked about it. He actually he had me questioning myself, and then I literally <laughs> saw a comment about the goons church. The funny like, thing soup. is that I know we did, and I'm just fucking with you. <laughs> I, I know. that I hate you. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. He pranked us. He pranked us. He got yeah, us. He really dude. got us with that one. He really so pranked us. Actually, face. Mm-hmm. speaking Currently of uh, speaking of pranksters, did you guys hear about uh, uh, about that YouTube prankster that uh, <laughs> that really got shot? 
Oh, they tried to stab a dude? Or pretended oh, to stab yeah. a dude? Okay, wow. so... Sounds it was, like a very uh, smart guy. Dude, it, the worst thing is, I, I like, I watched um, Critical did a video about it, and, like, mm -hmm. he talked about how... Like, I didn't even know this was a part of YouTube. There's uh, YouTube pranksters who, like, think it's funny to pretend to jump people. I didn't realize that that like was, random like... random people? Well, most of them are set up. So this is why this guy got shot. Yeah. Because I get... Uh, because wasn't. obviously they don't say, hey, this prank is set up, because, you know... Their fan base oh, is the he, like he was jumping someone and then someone yeah, else like, like it, came in and shot him. No, Some, yeah. So the guy that he defended yeah, himself. Yeah, the guy that thought he was about to get stabbed, who's never seen this guy in his life and just got chased down with like a knife or whatever it was. Um, yeah, he just fucking shot him because what, what else would you yeah, do when there's die. somebody chasing? Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. There's somebody oh, chasing yeah, you with a knife. Like you're gonna you're gonna shoot, especially in a so wait, in let, America. Wait, wait, let me let me get this right. This guy. Was pranking a random person by pretending to jump him? Yes, with a knife in America. With a how does yes. in America, America that where everyone is armed? Prank? It's not. It's not. See, that's, that's the thing. thing. It's gotten so out of control now. Like anything's a prank. You could like go up and punch the Pope and be like, "It's just a prank, Pope." Oh, that's yeah, not really bro. how that works. They think they think no, it's it's just, they think saying it's just a prank is like a safety statement where no matter what you did, it now becomes irrelevant because you said right. it's a prank. At that it's point, like the cops show up to point, arrest him laugh. and they're, they're, he's like, "It's just a prank." And they're like, oh, yeah. okay, sir, go about your day. It's okay. like, oh my bad. Yeah, you yeah, just yeah, like right, behead cool. somebody at Walmart and then tell them it's a prank, <laughs> so it doesn't matter. Like it's <laughs> it's it's not a safety word. Like you don't just get out of it. But it's just like prank channel. <laughs> ISIS pranks. <laughs> what a shitty prank! You couldn't think of anything better than to pr well, but that's pretend the thing. There's jump yeah, some random the person there, with there's, a knife. There's what people that do this. Happen? There is people that uh, do so this stupid. prank, like normally, and they just they it's well, obviously set it up. It's set up. So this guy call that like the, most prank they channels call are. that the fucking Darwinism prank. And if you die, then rightfully seriously. So. Oh yeah, no, I, was, yeah. I I don't think anybody's defending the guy. Natural that, selection yeah, prank, yeah, yeah. yeah, absolutely. But it's just, <laughs> it, it's genuinely sad that somebody looked up to YouTube prankster so much that he thought I'm gonna replicate that and had to fucking die for it. Like that is yeah, and then depressing. and then they're always having to like push the envelope right to 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 make it more and more exciting. So he's just like, yeah, I'll just jump a dude you know what? without telling him. This is Fousey for the views. Fault. I blame FouseyTube for pranking back in the day. <sighs> and who's the other one that did Whatever that? The guy with the him. black hair. He looked like a like a fuckboy emo kid. Um, oh, the guy that would basically like assault yeah, random yeah. women in the street. Uh -huh. What was his oh. name? Um, he was douchey too. Oh, are you guys oh, talking about the, the guy who's like, it's mommy makeout day? <laughs> My excuse yeah. me. Not that guy, but there was another that. guy too that used to you do You never that. seen yeah. that, Blark? No. Oh, yeah. I was just yeah, like, yeah, here yeah. at the park, <laughs> it's mommy makeout day. <laughs> yeah, like You're Eastry, like, Eastry did a, or like a, they did a, a interview with like one of the girls that he like did that with. Well, it's obviously that's Fake obviously set up. Yeah, like no is one's that, going to that, the park. It's like dude, there was one that was so or something? fuck. Yeah, Frank that's who it is. Yeah. I think, dude, there was one that was so fucking weird. Dude, it was like it's fucking mommy makeout day, and he was making out with this this woman, and this. <laughs> Her child was holding her hand while he was making out with her. <laughs> it was so fuck? fucking it was weird. Ew. What the hell? <laughs> Why? I was thinking of Sam Pepper, by the way. Oh, oh wow, that Sam is a name I've not he heard a, in a he long was like the time. People, piece of shit, Forgot man. he existed. Yeah. The only pranks that I find fucking hilarious are like when people put like a rope on a bike. And leave it at a park, and, like tie it to a tree, and somebody will try to steal it and ride away as fast as they can, and the bike will just stop dead because oh, yeah. it's tied oh, yeah. to a tree, and they just go flying. I feel if bad, <laughs> but it's like you know what? You're stealing something. Yeah. Fuck if it. If you're pranking people yeah. who are being shitty, then uh, yeah, it's perfectly fine. Yeah, although if that you're just, like, apparently fucking with the general public, it's like apparently like that is like a massive, uh, massive <laughs> issue. Apparently, it's very illegal to set up any sort of like baited booby traps even if they're meant to stop someone from doing something illegal like any sort of booby oh, trap really? is not allowed yeah which is yeah, kind of like almost, it's almost like entrapment in a way yeah i don't know i think it's uh i forget i forget what the what it is um it's the same reason 
police had to stop driving around in those buses and like looking for people to be on their phone. Um, I don't know if you guys remember when that was the thing, but no. they used to like pretend to have a public transport bus and it would just be full of cops just looking out the windows to see if people were on their phone. Um, oh my God, really? What the fuck? Yeah, I didn't know that happened. Yeah, How I do you forget. Pull, we just like pull over somebody on a bus. Like, yeah, literally like they'd get out and I, I don't know, I'd guess they'd just pull, pull the bus in front of them. But uh, like, I think they just meant to do it in traffic, but they weren't allowed to do that anymore because like apparently it's a crime that wouldn't exist if you weren't there to see it or so, it's so, i don't know it's some weird fucking loophole but they couldn't do it so i think booby trap falls into the same uh-huh. same weird weird spot but hmm. yeah i don't know it's it makes no sense but booby. all i know is it's fun to watch people try to ride a bike away and then go flying yeah, while the bikes back. are still yeah, yeah. <laughs> or there was actually you guys one gay god yeah, who Gay God? Guy drank, took a shot of his own jizz and, like, sampled his... I shouldn't talk about what this. What are you talking about? <laughs> what do you want? Of course watch? you're the only person that knows what the fuck that is. <laughs> no, 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 no. H3H3 did a video on this dude. Uh. He he got popular on YouTube. He went viral for, like, jizzing into a little shot glass and he drank his own jizz. The fuck? I, I'm the Some only one who remembers this. I've high seen so did many that. H3H3 videos I have not seen that. I do not remember that one. <laughs> <laughs> I swear this exists. That's I like swear your go-to H3H3 H3 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 experience. <laughs> <laughs> you guys remember Cone Shot Drink Guy? That's actually one of the only H3H3 H3 videos I've ever watched. Oh my god. Of course it was. <laughs> you are not right, well, like... Anyway. Like, we all know that you're straight. We we all know that. But you are not... You do not do a good job of proving that you're straight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like the gayest straight dude that's you ever are. been. You <laughs> are. Alive. <laughs> your life, your life, and your viewership and your career is based around penis. <laughs> that is true, and I just cross dressed for the first time on my <laughs> channel, so I'm not helping it. <laughs> yeah, I definitely practice that fucking yourself. girl voice. By the way, when I heard I, you, I, I did all the this voice is believable. I was like, this fucking guy, <laughs> right here. I watched, I watched a YouTubeable video before I went on, so I practiced for like ten or fifteen minutes. Bullshit! So, yeah, you're always like. Mm, ooh, ooh, Fucking shit but that's you different. Do. That's t- that's two different voices though. I can't I can't go on Omega and be like, oh wow, yeah, you want to hear a song? They're gonna be like, what the <laughs> hell is that? <laughs> I mean, it's Omega. You can do whatever you want, bro. <laughs> I guess so. But I just wanted okay. to be more believable. But do how long did it take you to get a boner after you cross dressed? That's what I want to know. Me did to you get jerk a, off oh, in that a, outfit? A dude. <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't jack off in the just, outfit. Just <laughs> nut on his own leg. <laughs> So like standing in a body mirror with your dick out over the tights. Just, oh, you could see my like man ass like leg hairs poking out through the tights, bro. There was nothing hot about it, really. You should have painted your nails nasty too. Nasty bags I, to differ. <laughs> your hands look so manly. Like what? Well, that's all I, I can know. pay attention to is your hands. You have like the most manly fucking arms. <laughs> like uh, you yeah. know what I know. It that's just why I had to wear those like fit. long sleeves. That's why yeah, I had to wear you those had gloves the, yeah. because I've. I've got like like veiny ass thin man hands. So. <laughs> you should have painted your nails. That would have been perfect. Next time I do this, which there will be a next time because one out of ten, uh, smile. <laughs> uh, I, I'll full send it, dude. I'm gonna wear like jewelry and and paint my nails oh and my shit. Oh my god, he's I'm going off the fucking it. deep end. <laughs> I think this is your like way of kind of telling the community Easy, you're thinking about into switching it. over. Yeah. <laughs> he's just dude, easing into it. Like, yeah, I actually kind of like. Yeah, I feel really comfortable in these clothes now. Bro, I got so many comments of like, this is dude's like secret way of like coming yeah, out as transitioning. <laughs> Dude just starts showing up to regular recording sessions <laughs> in that whole fucking get up. He's like, hi guys. <laughs> you know what? I'd What's support that? you, dude. I would be very proud of you. I need you to know well, that. I, I appreciate that. I wouldn't. Get the fuck off the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Who saw that one coming? Yeah, really. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, major compliment I got from the comments was like there was a lot of trans women, so dudes who became women that yeah. said that I I sounded more like a woman than they could. So get that, fucked. I I don't know. Uh, don't wow. it's a real yet. talent that you can sound more like a woman than <laughs> men who've actually had their nuts and dick cut off. Congratulations. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I do. I feel like they were weren't complimenting you. I took it as a compliment. Fuck you all. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, uh... 
<laughs> so a bunch of trannies said that I sound more like a woman than they do. <laughs> I took that as a bro, compliment. Bro, in like 20... Dude, you're they've been roasted by it. the trans community, dude. They're roasting they, your they ass. They got together They're to like claim you. Me. They're like, I got my nuts cut off and you sound more like a woman than I do. <laughs> Christ. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. It's a compliment. What the I, fuck do you mean? I have nothing. Listen. Listen, in 10 to 15 minutes, I could sound more like a woman than, than a dude who got his nuts chopped off. That's a compliment. Uh, oh, I'm going to crush shit. a bottle of uh, <laughs> You know what, Nick Nasty? I actually All appreciate right. that for uh, once. I actually appreciate you distracting oh, everyone dude. from the conversation at hand. <laughs> Man, I'm actually there's tears. I'm crying too. Uh, I actually had a question for all you guys. I was thinking about this earlier. Do you guys have any like drafts saved on your on your Twitter? Oh, I don't know. I actually no, question. I don't think so. I like recently like took a screenshot of my drafts and posted them and like deleted them. No, I actually have no drafts right now. I just you don't have anything no. fucked up saved in there. No, I feel like whenever I come up with something that I'm like, I want to tweet that. I just do it. I don't like. I'll save that for later. Like I know Smitty, Smitty's drafts on his phone are just fucked. Like every time he thinks of a tweet, he just saves it. <laughs> Why? It's probably the smart like, thing to do, though. Honestly, I'll be eating dinner and you'll just be like, oh, I just thought of a tweet. Like what? <laughs> It, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I just that, that's probably smart care. because then he can go back and be like in an hour and be like, yeah, that was fucking stupid, or like you know, like <laughs> think about it before he just well, says it. Thing. Do you it's ever, like, do you guys ever tweet something and then like it doesn't do good and you end up deleting it? No, I'm not very no. insecure about my Twitter likes. Sometimes I like if, if I tweet something like that's not just like a update or something that's like a video or something. Like if I tweet something that I'm like, okay, this might be like a joke or something. And then it just does terrible. I'm just like, okay, just delete that. <laughs> Nobody else does that? No. Uh, nah. I guess it's just me then. I just leave it on my page as a reminder of my failures. My failures. <laughs> my past pain. And everything I couldn't be. So, no, McNasty, I don't I do not do that. I'm sure I'm sure somebody on that listens can relate, though. I'm sure you Probably, at least got yeah, one yeah. guy that's You're alone. insecure about his Twitter likes. <laughs> You're alone. Dude, you got roasted by the trans community. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> That's not a roast. Dude. You're fucked up. That's not a roast, dude. <laughs> that was a compliment. Well, I'll I'll think of it as a roast. So, well. <laughs> me and my trans That's community that watch me will think of it as a compliment. I really hope okay. they comment on this and are just like, <laughs> it was not a compliment. <laughs> we hate you. <laughs> Please stop. Yeah, dude, you took that wrong, dude. You're appropriating <laughs> us. Please fucking stop. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Topic. Uh, I don't have one. Oh, dude, all the topics are so fucking shit. Spaghetti or meat. <laughs> yeah. They're just... Suggest dude. better topics, chat. Well, my topic was about... Drafts. And yeah, I know we know. covered that. Yeah, and we, we all didn't have well, drafts. Well, no one asked me if I had any. Do you so have any drafts? I mean, drafts. I was dra looking. Do you have and drafts? I saw, <laughs> do I have a draft in my house? It's called. <laughs> um, I I was looking through, okay. and some of them are pretty shitty, and I'm glad I didn't tweet them. Um, do you want to share some with one, the class? Yeah, there's one that says if Mein Kampf was a manga. Y'all, Weeaboos would be renamed to We Kill Juice. <laughs> oh my that, god. That, that ain't it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that should stay a draft, dude. Yeah. 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 There's a reason why it's in the Um Why aren't baby wipes called adult wipes? Babies suck at wiping, they literally have to wear diapers. That's yeah, fucking the, awful. These That's should terrible. all stay in the draft. <laughs> the other one was funny. <laughs> this is why it's like traps, an, that's bro. an anti joke, dude. That's not even. It's just like, why was the plumber sad? His parents died. It's like it's on par with that. Why well, can't babies use wipes? They're bad at it. 
<laughs> They're literally babies. <laughs> Thank you guys for reminding me why I saved it as a draft. <laughs> yeah, don't don't tweet those ones out. <laughs> well, the first one wasn't bad. It was just like really fucked up, but it was Yikes. funny. That second one was just dumb. I lol. Yeah, you're fucking dumb. You didn't even dumb. you didn't even read one of yours. You literally, you go, you, you go you are literally insecure of your tweets and will delete them. Don't exactly. call my fucking jokes dumb. I'm I smart enough not to fucking post them. <laughs> Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> yeah, you know what? At least Soup doesn't post them in the first place, McNasty. <laughs> and yeah, you kiss fuck. my fucking ball, bitch? Kiss my damn ball, bitch. That's like right. something you would tweet right there. Yeah. McNasty, kiss you have the worst bitch. Twitter out of all of us. I don't want to hear it. The end. I don't know. Dude's Twitter's pretty fucking terrible. No. What? Well, dude just Literally doesn't tweet. tweet dude's just, just like, like guitar requests for a video. video. <laughs> Give me a song to play in a oh, video. Yeah, that's the way it yeah, should be. You. That's fuck the way you it should be. Fuck you for not having a social media addiction, dude. Here's my fuck new you. video. Give me a song to play no, in a video. You Update do it the best. everyone about everything. You do it the best, dude. I respect I, it. I use Twitter to like reply to other people. I don't have like a whole or lot of shit to say myself. Spam Yeah, that was fun. Fuck you. No, it wasn't. Fake redneck. Die. Just actually die. <laughs> All right, here's How a... How do you want me to die? Here's a here's a fire topic for the boys. <laughs> what would your make-a-wish be? <laughs> oh my God. Um, well, mine's coming quicker. true right now. I'm on a podcast. <laughs> to die quicker. <laughs> to die quicker. <laughs> <laughs> well, can the Make-A-Wish Foundation grant that? Can they just kill a kid? <laughs> they just, they just make bring you to just fucking end it all. <laughs> <laughs> they just bring you to a fucking forest kill me. and off you. <laughs> they My hire like a professional is fucking... Isis. Okay. Did you see Dwayne Isis? <laughs> Just a joint. Not a joint. Dwayne Isis. Dwayne Isis. It was to meet Dwayne Isis. <laughs> Dwayne the Isis Johnson. I think that's slander. That's slander. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. Rock. <laughs> Rock. <laughs> Rock. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, trying, I'm trying to think of my make a wish. I wonder if The Rock's son is named Kid Rock. No, because that's already a famous artist. Yeah. I think that was his On joke. That's a, that's a tweet that needs to What would your make a wish be, McNasty? <laughs> uh, over the rainbow. Um, probably to like, um, probably, hmm, meet Steve Vai. I was going to say play on stage with Steve Vai. Nah. If it doesn't involve I, Steve Vai, he's like. If I really wanted to try, I could probably like end up meeting him somehow. I don't know. I feel like he's easily meetable. Absorbed. Yeah. I, feel, yeah. I just feel like he's like meetable. easily meetable. Like what he's famous, mean? but he's not like, he's not like fucking like Kendall Jenner famous. You know, he's not like Over fucking. Over here, Steve Vai, Mike Sage video. Over here, <laughs> Steve Vai. <laughs> <laughs> I, I somewhat I get what you I somewhat get what you mean. I mean, <laughs> right. yeah, he's it's, famous, it's the, but he's not like a list fucking. Yeah. Name. Right. Like at least it's for our generation, like, like, like an older generation, George Clooney or somebody. Yeah, I feel like last generation would would know him a lot better. I than should ours, just DM but. him and show him the, the DM fucking him universe guitar. I have. Does he follow you? Like I just try and like try and DM. I don't know. He's fucking old. I I, I don't really think that he knows like. <laughs> Wow. Send him media a, really well. Send him a fax. Why don't you Morse code him? <laughs> send him in? a picture of your car fax. <laughs> yeah, yeah, do that. No. <laughs> okay. Fair oh. I understand. What decision. would your make a wish be? Um, I want to play basketball with Obama. <laughs> Why? <laughs> you thought about that. Your little cracker ass. <laughs> you would get roasted by everyone, dude. Bro, mama Bro. You your ankles. I could jump pretty high. The Fuck blacks you. of Twitter would fucking roast you, and Don't I would call them dude, that. I would. <laughs> I would. Of Twitter. Yeah. <laughs> it's not okay. Hold on. The blacks you of play, Twitter. You playing basketball with Obama <laughs> is. <laughs> Well, I can't. This is my make a wish, dude. I'm dying. Let me play basketball Good. with Obama. They'd be like, this little white boy couldn't have died sooner. He's just <laughs> ruining my day. 
Wow. <laughs> it's ruining my day knowing that dude is playing basketball with Obama. I can't go you on to it today. Cracker fucking white ass playing basketball with Obama. <laughs> that would just be embarrassing. He'd be better yes. off dead. <laughs> they just see this wow. guy who's whiter than the backside of a, a pop tart. Wait a minute. What makes you think he's good at basketball? <laughs> That's the one make a wish they wouldn't grant. <laughs> wow. Thanks for shitting on my dream of playing basketball you back with Obama, to the hospital. guys. <laughs> this is something I've wanted since 2012. Weird. Shut the fuck up. You're a weird little guy. <laughs> you're, you're a weird, hairy little fella, dude. I'll tell you what. <laughs> you voted that just since 2012? You're like a human Dobby. <laughs> you're just like this weird little thing that just runs around. And you're just like obsessed with socks and shit. And you're like, I want to put basketball with Obama. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Holy shit. Because I want to play basketball with Obama. <laughs> yes, and he had to say it like that, too. He's he so too dumb. obsessed with socks, and we just didn't know? What do you mean? I don't know. I it's just like this little thing that's that. just there, you know? Just skitters around like little... That's like you when you walk just around. Like a spider sprinting, <laughs> like... <laughs> I don't understand well, where this is Zuber's coming like, from. like, ready, you're just like... Is it <laughs> you can run on all fours? <laughs> it's, it's socks. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> it's on all fours. Harm yourself. Harm yourself in some way. That's why, dude do doesn't have, that's why dude doesn't have a girlfriend. He doesn't want to see... Or she doesn't want her to see him running on all fours for dinner. <laughs> just skittering around the wall like a lizard. <laughs> just like drifting around <laughs> corners. I don't even know what to say anymore. All I said is I want to play basketball with Obama. Oh, uh, fuck this little cracker kid. I don't want to play basketball with him. <laughs> Amanda, we gotta do it. Fuck Amanda? Him. Who's Amanda? <laughs> I didn't say Amanda. It's like it's Amanda. Cause, can, can somebody else talk about their dreams? Amanda, Obama. Obama. Del Michelle, that's <laughs> my secret lover. Amanda. This podcast sucks. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Holy I, shit. Let's talk about somebody else's dream so I can shit on it for 20 minutes. Go on. <laughs> well, who's got a dream? Uh, Martin Luther Martin King. Martin Luther, dream. yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay, all right. Uh, all right, so who has a... So who else has a make-a-wish? Don't worry about what happened there. Um, <laughs> uh, I, don't, I don't... It was very bad. <laughs> I don't know what my make-a-wish... Like my make-a-wish would probably be, like, to fuck somebody, but I can't think of That's who I so want to fuck. I would want to ass-fuck Nicolas Cage. <laughs> I don't want to make Nicolas Cage's colon bleed. Your white cracker ass fucking Nicolas Cage. Yes. Yeah, dude, it doesn't work when you do it. No, it doesn't work when you do it. Like, you guys' porno or something? My white cracker ass fucking Nicolas Cage. And then the bottom just says, yes. I feel like that would just be one of your YouTube video titles. Yeah, I can see that. I can absolutely see that. Like if you made a joke about Nicolas Cage in a video or something, you just like, pile driving in his asshole. I can't wait to see Soup's titles in 10 years from now if he's still making videos. Like, you were just going to give up. They're just going to be so deep <laughs> Who says I haven't already? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, at least... You, so much effort in as At it least is. you put, like, 2% effort right now. Like, you're just going to go right Generous. down to zero. See, I always say to myself, I'm going to go with whatever I feel and think at the moment. I never want to put too much thought into things where and I overthink it and fuck it up. you think of deep fried Osama Bin Laden in a thumbnail. That's your go-to. Of course. <laughs> yeah. Like, dude, if, if it makes me laugh... Or, you know, something like that. That is my process. I never think, oh, maybe, maybe not. I'm like, that's funny. Fuck it. That's what's happening. <laughs> I, I love it. Yeah, what man, a, what a free spirit. <laughs> well, I mean, if it works, it works. And if it, if it doesn't, then what, hey. What I like about that so much is that so many YouTubers, like us included, like are out here trying to perfect the thumbnail, perfect the title, yeah, perfect the, the algorithm, tags, the, hit the algorithm just, as perfectly as possible. You just put up deep fried Osama in Arabic text. And like, <laughs> you're just like so against the grain. I love it. <laughs> yeah, I that's mean, also my mindset too. Is like I, it's kind of like a, a, I don't know, like an alternative look on how other YouTubers title and do their shit. Because I like to make mine kind of. Like as deep fried and saturated and fucked as possible, so it will stand out. But like, yeah, it does amongst, stand out. Like millions yeah. of content creators uploading the same shit. 
Like right. literally infinite yep. amount of haha funny <laughs> moments CSGO videos. So it, it, yep. I mean, it works for you to stand out. Because so I mean, like if I was it. to just upload like funny Counter Strike video with a regular thumbnail, I mean, I feel like I wouldn't be nearly as popular as I am now if it was the, it, sure. literally the same content, but a different thumbnail and title. Your fans would be you like, know? "Soup's changed. He's washed up. We miss the autism." I, dude, I get that now. <laughs> I fucking get that. <laughs> Why? Because you don't now. drink. Why? Because you was have, it like two gallons of milk and then puking. You have a thumbnail artist now. Yeah, I was gonna say because somebody actually draws you nice looking thumbnails. Uh. <laughs> Is it Cajun? Cajun. Yeah. 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 What was that? What was that one video you had, Soup? That your class saw that you drank a bunch of milk or something? Uh, it was. Wasn't I think it, it was the one where video? I. No, it was the one where I drank like Sprite and ate bananas with a bunch oh, of my yeah, friends from school. It. And yeah. I told all my friends, I was like, yeah, don't really like say anything about this. So people, you know, won't talk about it. I'm glad it wasn't it. the video of the kid on COD like calling you the N word. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be so awkward to watch in class. <laughs> no fucking kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Good and observation, McBestie. He's calling him a damn Yankee the whole time. A damn Yankee. <laughs> <laughs> You're like 14. <laughs> He's not changed. That's so weird how long you've been doing YouTube. Yeah, I know. It's yeah. weird that you're the youngest out of us and you've been doing YouTube for the longest. Dude, how many years that, do you think you've been doing it? My channel's not even my first YouTube channel, dude. I had like a whole other like... Yeah, I think fucking, you told me about that. Yeah, That's I had a fun. whole other like Mario channel that I did when I was Oh yeah, I remember you talking about yeah. that. So, you think you've dude, been on, so young. You think you've been on YouTube for a decade? Like a whole... Oh, dude, absolutely. I mean, the Soup channel was made in 2009. Holy shit. And that's not even my first one. (laughs) Jeez, dude, when was yours made? The, The My current channel was made in like 2012, but I had a couple channels before that back in like 2008 and 9. Holy shit. So See, that's, yeah, we probably that's started nuts. around the same 2017. time. <laughs> yeah, I started in 2017. Yeah, like that's when I started uploading. Yeah. That's I wild. Would, I would probably say that uh, I've been doing it since about 2007. Damn, that's so around when Smitty started too. I was like, Either like 2006, 2006 like subs. Yeah, I started. Yeah, I was real early house. to it. I started back when the the channel layout was you could put a background behind yep, everything and you dude, could scroll that was them sick. down. The, it looked like a MySpace page. Mm-hmm. Yeah, pretty much. That. Yeah, I never uploaded during those days, but I remember watching like Maple Story tutorials on that layout. <laughs> yeah, that would like, that kill mush so cancerous. Dude, it it That's was just... so painful. Like everybody tried to use like cool edgy like colors, and you just could not read anything. That'd be like <laughs> purple with like. Dark purple text. <laughs> yeah, literally just could not read <laughs> anything at all. Ugh, the yeah, good old days. Right there. Yeah. Yeah, I remember like going on somebody's channel back in the day and seeing like they'd have like 3,500 subs. I'm like, holy shit. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, back when a, a, a hundred thousand or a million was like unobtainable. Like that's insane yeah. numbers. Mm hmm. Now you all gotta do, do is you- chase people with knives and die. Do you guys, uh, do you guys remember the first YouTuber that you guys, like, committed to watching? Not just, like, stumbled on their video once or twice, but, like, oh, really? Wow, you've stuck Uh, with that, because you still watch them, don't you? I I, I don't really know much out nowadays, but back before I did YouTube, I would watch them a lot. I would just sit on my couch and just jerk my little pecker off Markiplier. I don't like his content, (laughs) but I, I love him as a person. He just seems so, like... Genuinely yeah, he's really genuine. Good. But yeah, he's just I think like, the, like he's just like the first like YouTuber I got into, so I just kind of like stayed with him for the longest time. Mine was critical, oddly enough. Oh really? So I was fucking. I didn't start stoked. watching him up until like recently. <laughs> I was stoked when I met him. Well, I used to watch Equal Three on and off, like just because what the fuck else was there on YouTube? And yeah. then oh I, yeah, and then Equals Three put in Critical's video of him playing Quop. Yeah, and I, I thought that was the funniest thing I've ever watched in my life. So yep. everything that Critical uploaded for like, God, probably three or four years, I just watched immediately. Dude, I wish I had fucking Critical's channel. 
If she uploads so the dumbest easy, shit and mode. gets like two million, he's been playing well, fucking okay, but speed running fair, Mr. Krabs game for like a month. To be like fair, he's, he's he is video. a fantastic YouTuber. He, his fair, channel is crazy. Yeah. He brought his channel back. It was like dead for a bit. Like it was. Oh really? Yeah, for a while. Um, probably around like 2015, 14 ish. Unless I'm misremembering, but I just remember seeing him getting like a hundred to two hundred k views, like max. And now uh-huh. he's like, if it's under a million views, like something's wrong with that video. <laughs> like, yeah, his channel does insane. But yeah, he well, is. He's, uh, he's a he big inspiration for me because I like to upload a lot, and he he's just the definition of a YouTuber that can upload literally fucking anything, and people will watch it. Uh-huh. And that's that dude. That's like the goal, <laughs> honestly. Just being able to upload any kind of shit. Yep. And have people, people watch are just it. there for you. Yep. That's that's the dream of any YouTuber. Apparently he, uh, for the first like, I don't know, probably five or six years of his YouTube career, apparently he donated every dollar he made off YouTube. I don't know if it's true, but yeah, he did. I heard that, that is, and it went to like that is nuts. I it mean, went to like, like charities that were um, unfortunately like sketchy though that he didn't know about at the time. I think. Oh, that's AIDS. I like. I yeah. love being generous, but fucking could never donate yeah, all, of all of my it. money. I would. I would <laughs> cry myself to sleep every night. <laughs> Like, oh, yeah, I don't know. He's uh, <clears throat> he's his own breed. We should get him on the podcast. Should, yeah, should do any of us have enough contacts on. with him? <laughs> well, he follows me on Twitter. I've well, never actually go. spoke to him, though. Mr. Sir Critical, will you come do Hour of Talk? Like he's going to go. watch this or something, and, and he's going to watch it to the very <laughs> he's gonna end. He's going to watch it all the way through. <laughs> he's going to watch all in. the way through. Yep. He's been waiting for us to ask him on. I'm going to my fingernails for the last five minutes of the podcast. You've been what? So I'm gonna cut my fingernails the last five minutes. Please don't. That is like my biggest pet peeve sound. I hate that. There we go. Right here. Yeah. uh, Critical follows me. I was was curious as to why. (laughs) Stop! (laughs) It's me, fingernail cutter. Dude, I hate that sound. Stop! (laughs) I'm gonna leave. I will leave. Why? I hate that. I'm deafening. (laughs) (laughs) You muted. He just deafened. That is gross, McNasty. Are you done? Oh, uh, stop. That was a big one. Was that stop. your thumb? That was, that was a thumb, yeah. That sounded like a thumb. <laughs> okay, Dude, these, I, think, I think it's about I think time. This is give me one more chance. Okay. That was hell. I hate that sound. We should end with you clipping your nails. That's, that's gross. <laughs> that's nails on a chalkboard to me. Stop. I gotta do it. I gotta do it for the, you for don't the have to do it right now. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, why All is this right, an everyone, emergency? Uh, please like, <laughs> like, and subscribe. Really gonna be the end? Please well, like, subscribe. What do you mean? You, you did this to yourself. You're clipping you? your fucking nails while you're supposed to be working. You. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you're I am leaving, motherfucker. You sound like you're gonna say something that started with an end right there. No, I wanted no. to call you a retard actually, but I stopped myself. Oh. Good job, Thanks, anyway. You're the bigger person. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing you didn't say that word. <laughs> <laughs> like right. and subscribe, download the podcast, and start fam. Do the button. Oh yes, the button. Oh yes, the button. What about praise Allah? Praise Allah. Don't bite him. Download on Spotify. Like, like, and comment, and subscribe. Goodbye. Goodbye forever.